and production ready by adding libraries, common patterns, utils, reducers, and sagas. My goal at this course is to share with you my findings of the last few years about what steps and decisions are better to make at the beginning of development so that you will have a good starting point for your new project. We will bootstrap the new project with Create React app and right from the start we'll add a tool that automatically formats our code. For state management we will use Redux and we'll take a look at how to organize reducers the right way. Then we'll introduce React Router to our app. For styling we'll use styled components and we'll find how to better manage UI them. Then we add Storybook a development environment for UI components. To make side effects easier to manage, we will use Redux Saga. Also, we will implement common patterns for authorization so that later we will only need to add requests to the API. Then we talk about how to make our progressive web app installable. In the end, we will add tools for your road tracking and analytics. All source code you will find in the repository. Each part will have a link to the corresponding commit and names of libraries we need to install. There is a lot of things to cover in the short course, so let's jump in.